Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your girl, Philly Girl 31. Welcome back to another video. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Happy Tuesday, yo. Your girl had to get up early this morning because she had to go grocery shopping. Didn't want to, but you know what? I needed to. So, this is a grocery haul for y'all. Wound up saving a lot of money today. I wound up shopping on the Navy base. So, yes, let's go. Before we jump into this haul, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Y'all, we getting close to that 1,500 subscriber goal, okay? <laughs> so, if you're watching, and I know you're watching, come on and hit that subscribe button for your girl. Yes, all right, guys. So, y'all already know your girl's still on her. But if you don't know if you knew, your girl has been on her health journey, her health kick, whatever you want to call it trying to live right, eat right, do right, be right type of deal. So I've been more cautious when it comes to um, what I buy. I haven't been eating out. So I did have a uh, two meals on Mother's Day. That was my cheat day Sunday, okay? I did have two meals that uh, when I went to brunch and the other one, they got me... Um, chilies so but other than that your girl do not eat out everything i eat will be at the house but um your girl gonna go ahead and jump in to this little haul i will wash my hands because it's dirty out there okay <laughs> and i'm definitely using my um bath and body works soap because this soap be soap so we're gonna go ahead and use our bath and body works so, so wash our hands. I did get some good deals, y'all, on a lot of these groceries. The one thing I can say is, you know, if you're affiliated with the military, you know, you can get some benefits, you know. <laughs> groceries being one of them, okay? So, I'm going to tell you what I'm talking about. So, I usually shop at either... Um, Food Lion, Harris Teeter, um, Kroger, stuff like that. So, those stores are a little bit more pricier than most. It is what it is. So, up first, I've been wanting some cream. Well, not cream. Some corn on the cob, right? But I want street corn. So, I'm going to make my own. So, I got this street corn seasoning. This is by The Spice Lab cooking inspiration i think i paid like three dollars for this and this is five ounces so it's real simple all you got to do is make your corn get you some um butter you can use garlic butter and you can uh, melt the butter on top of the corn and sprinkle this on it or you can um add some butter to a bowl that's melted you know what i'm saying add the seasoning to it and then put your corn in mix it up or whatever and you got street corn so and you can put like cilantro on top but yeah so i got that my cream raspberry this was two dollars and like 92 cents yes and this is 64 fluid ounces this is the ones i usually buy but two dollars under three dollars for some cranberry juice i'm here for it um I did get some fruits and vegetables. So this is my bell pepper. My bananas, y'all already know. Um, for me, bananas don't have to be ripe. I like to get them that way they can ripen at the house. But I like to get them green. <laughs> don't ask y'all, don't ask. That's just, I don't know. That's just the weirdness to me, I don't know. Baby, when I tell you that last little pineapple I had got, y'all already know I had to give me another one. That pineapple was delicious, okay? So, yes. This is great for snacking. You know, like sometimes when you sit around the house and you be like, dang, I'm hungry. Cut up some pineapple. I put it in my glass container in the fridge. It lasts longer. And I can just pull it out, eat it, boom. So, that's that. I did get another thing of cranberry juice. I 
I got me some sweet and creamy International Delight coffee creamer. Um, I want to say this was like three dollars and like twenty nine cents, something like that. The pineapple, I want to say the pineapple was like a dollar forty nine, dollar fifty ish. I don't know, something like that. <laughs> Alright, let's get into this meat because y'all know your girl don't eat meat like that, but I do eat turkey. So I got me some sweet Italian lean turkey sausages from Shady Brooks. Yes, this right here is everything, okay? If you know, you know. I got me some turkey breast cutlets. I got two packs of those. Now this right here is great for those people who like pork chops. You know, you want to fry your pork chops or bake your pork chops. I get turkey breast cutlets and it has, it's marinated in turkey broth. So I got two of them also from Shady Brooks. Um, oh, y'all want to know the price? $5.66, <laughs> $5.17. And then I got me a turkey was Probably like $4, something like that. Not too bad, not too shabby. I got me some more fruits. I got two things of strawberries. These are from California. Um, these were two for four. I got me and Zoe some blueberries. These were $2 and like, 89 cents, something like that. Um, I got me some Kraft single cheese, American style, because I like grilled cheese sandwiches. I don't know, it's just something about that cheese. <laughs> I don't know, I just, I don't know. I also get cheese from the, from the deli too, so don't come with me in the comments, okay? I get fresh uh, cheese that they slice up for me too, but that right there, I just need that for my grilled cheese. I got me a bag of cucumbers, the little ones. They're easy to cut up, make a salad, whatever. All right, so Bay likes his sweets. So stays in the place, what's up girl? Now remember that Sakatimi cake we were talking about? I finally found it. So this is the sliced Sakatimi cream cake. <laughs> this is what it looks like. This is $4.99, so. When I try it, I'm gonna let you know, girl. I got me some fresh baked croissants or crescent rolls, whatever, you, however you wanna say it. This was $3.29. Normally they like $5.99, $6.99, but I should've got two packs because I love me some croissants, but it is what it is. <laughs> and then this is my receipt. And I'll tell you what, my total is when we finish. All right. Let me know in the comments down below what you think my soul is. I don't know if I told y'all in the beginning of the video, but if I didn't guess, okay. I got me some Peter Pan peanut butter, the creamy kind. This one got uh, eight grams of protein in it. I think the other one that I use has Protein, protein, protein. Seven grams of protein. So if you're worrying about your protein, you want to have a lot of that protein in your life, don't buy Skippy, this natural one, because this is only seven grams. <laughs> that Peter Pan come through with one more gram of protein. So eight grams of protein. So when I finish that, Peter Pan will be, will be gotten. I got me some soft street tacos. Yes, I love these things, the Hawaiian, sweet Hawaiian kind. Yes. If you know, you know. All right, um, from the deli, I got me some boar's head. Yes, boar's head is the best meat to me, hands down. I did get me a pound of the head pit crab slow smoked turkey. Okay, and it was $15.17. This was the most, this was the most expensive thing I've gotten. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is more expensive than regular meat, you feel me? But we like turkey sandwiches, you know? I mean, it's a great snack when I don't feel like cooking. 
and I just want something quick. You gotta get fresh though, y'all. Y'all y'all can't be eating these um, lunch meats that come in a little pack. You gotta go to the deli and get it cut off of that that block. You feel me? Like you need it in your life. I got me some baby Roma tomatoes <laughs> for my salad or my sandwiches, whatever. Um, Akira Janae here on YouTube. She is a big YouTuber. She's like, I don't know. I, I want to say maybe she's like at 30 some thousand subscribers, but I love her. I love watching her. I've been following her for a long time. I love her spending the weeks with me, but um, she always does the fresh either mashed potatoes or a baked potato. So when I was like, you know what, I watched her, not her last video, but a few videos. She had some um, potatoes and I was like, dang, I want me some. So this was like $2.50. The Roma tomatoes, I want to say they were like, Maybe a dollar fifty for the three. I got me some fresh express spinach. I like to add these to my eggs or um, my sandwiches, my salad. Uh, I change it up between regular lettuce and spinach. I got me some shredded iceberg lettuce. Uh, the spinach was a dollar eighty seven. The iceberg was $2. From the deli department, I did get me some garlic spread. You know, to add to like your garlic bread or whatever. Oh, you can also cook with this too, like your veggies, stuff like that. But this is fresh, so I was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and add it. That's what I'm gonna use for my street corn, so. When I saw it, I was like, oh yeah. We're almost done, guys. I'm sorry, we're almost done. Um, for my little sausages, I got me some Pepperidge Farm Top Slice Sweet Hawaiian Hot Dog Buns. This one, I like it to where you can open it from the top because it's easier to toast and put your sausages in. So, I had to do it, okay. <laughs> and... I got me some tuna fish. The uh, bread was two dollars and like um, eighty nine cent for the Hawaiian um, hot dog buns. These were ninety four cents. Chicken of the sea, wild caught, light tuna. You want to try to get the freshest kind of tuna that you can without buying it actually fresh. So wild caught, always buy wild caught, guys. Okay. These were ninety four cents a pack, and I got four of them. And this is made in spring water, okay? We keeps it real, 70 calories. High in protein. Protein is like 17 grams a pack. So these are other options, other ways for you to get your protein intake. For those of you who do not eat meat, okay? Your girl could, I mean, turkey is great and everything, but sometimes people want meat meat, you know, steak and pork and all of that, but don't forget about tuna fish, <laughs> high in protein. I got Bay his Dunkin' Caramel Me, Caramel Me Crazy <laughs> ground coffee. He drinks it black. He doesn't add any cream or nothing to his coffee. He prefers this straight up. I make it, I steep it for him and I do it for like 24 hours and it makes like a 64 ounce jug, mason jar or whatever, but he has to have this. Um, and the last bag is my potato chips because I forgot to get my popcorn. I like Smart Foods popcorn, like that right there, hands down, that white cheddar. Woo! Mmm. If you don't want something to me. And what was that? That was like $7 for the uh, coffee. And then the Cape Cod Sweet Mesquite Barbecue. These are 40% less fat. They're um, kettle cooked. Only kind of chips we eat in the house. 
These were $2.50 in a bag. So I got the sweetness tea, the sweet spice tea, and sweet and spicy jalapeno. Sour cream and onion, they're all two fifty. And my last bag was another one of the barbecue, the sweet and sweet barbecue. Because if you know, you know. <laughs> all right, guys, that is all I got for my grocery haul. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Okay, so if you guessed it in the comment section let me see if you right i paid 119 dollars and seven cents before tax or fees because they don't have taxes on base but before fees it was 117.32 so that wasn't bad at all okay so all right guys i still need to grab like water I want some bagels because I want some breakfast sandwiches in the morning and maybe two other things. And I'll just go get that from um, Food Lion. I don't have to go back on base to get it because it is what it is. But um, thank you guys for rocking out with your girl. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace, guys. Later.